everyone's like, wow, like we, nobody saw this coming. It wasn't even like talked about. It was nothing, you know, there was a few rumors here and there, but nothing enough that it was like broadcast where people would like really, you know, ask me. And uh, it was, it was actually, I mean, I was even surprised. I got the call that, you know, it was, you know, almost 11.30 at night on the East Coast time. I'm just sitting in my bed. I get a phone call from um, uh, Bobby Reagan. He goes, uh, you ready to ride a blue bike? And I said, yes, sir. I mean, he woke me up out of my sleep. You know, I had to, it was almost like one of those ones where you're like, you have to look twice. You're like, is this right? Is this right? <laughs> so uh, it was a cool feeling. And um, just to, you know, it, it just get those nerves rushing. If any time, you know, you finally get your chance of, you know, signing with a new year, you get this, it's like this, weird like rush you know like as you're signing the paper you know it's just like man like this this is happening again and and it's just that feeling even when I was just from a rookie you know what I mean when I was first set, did my first deal it's just that 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 feeling that you're just like man like all the hard work is like finally done once that name's done you know what I mean now it's you know now it's like the easiest thing is just go out here and go ride you know the search is done and um, now I've been focused on I had such a great off season with the with the whole team and learning new things, the new bike. Like I said, the bike's great. So, uh, yeah, you know, all the work's done. It's just a matter of just go racing. All the hard work's done, so let's just have fun now. The biggest thing that motivates me, um, honestly, is uh, really just seeing a lot of African-American kids that are coming up in, in the dirt bikes. Um, you know, I definitely want to continue to, the, when I, whenever I'm, I'm in Florida or wherever I am and I'm seeing these African-American kids that are looking at me and being like, man, I, that's so cool, you know, I want to do what you do, and, you know, and it's, it's like starting to expand, and now you're seeing these kids are steady, you know, growing up and doing it. That's what really motivates me to continue to keep doing it and paving that way and keeping the torch lit. So uh, it's, it's awesome. It's a cool feeling, that, you know, to be, to go back home and, and see all those people uh, just, you know, pulling for me. It's, uh, it, it's an awesome feeling, honestly, and that's, that's the motivation. And, and you know, the fact that, you know, me and my brother, uh, of course, my brother's, you know, one of the first ones that, to do it. And then, you know, me and, and to continue to keep tor that torch lit. And, and now we have another rider, Jalik Swole. You know, he's in the professional ranks. And we have a few uh, kids in the amateur. You know, without that, you know, you got to have a platform to, to start that. It's just like uh, Bubba Wallace was in NASCAR. Now you're starting to see other uh, African Americans, you know, trying for NASCAR. So uh, Lewis Hamilton is another one. So it's. Uh, I guess I would say that platform is, is a cool thing that motivates them and, and it motivates me.